Howdy everyone, it's me once again, the one and only Killer Rodan. And today, I still have some Disney films to review for you. And in fact, I mean, this insane asylum is not a good sign right off the bat, folks. And oh boy, and that film I'm going to be reviewing, oh, this movie, folks, the third installment of this series of films they already made. I know, before anyone tells me, I technically didn't review the second part yet. I did review the first part a while back, and I get to the second one whenever I feel like it. So I'm fully aware I'm reviewing these sort of out of order, so I do it when I do it, okay folks? As usual, let's just get into the plot, shall we, and get it over with. As you can see folks, this is an animal themed film with the dogs as the primarily focus of this film. When Poppy and Co. moved to a luxurious hotel, his youngest pup feels neglected and must go show how, how special she actually is. That's basically the just, uh, the just of the film really, as hard as that sounds. This pop I'm speaking of name is named Rosa, and really, that's such a common name for Hispanic people, folks. You just had to call her Rosa, really? And she doesn't come off, she's been neglected. So she, has, she has friends, or at least I think they're friends anyway family I guess right, so I guess she has plenty of company going on so that doesn't really make any sense really technically speaking her father did check on her from time to time I guess so what within the Hispanic cultures having a large family is definitely a key element for the whole unit and of course always inviting people in these large gatherings this film does attempt to employ that in his storyline, but it even manages to do that wrong as well because there was nothing interesting, like, at all. It's a boring, family-friendly movie overall. And for such a basic, run-at-the-mill storytelling, it even manages to mess that up. And I don't know how, probably because of his bad writing. That's probably how it goes. Yeah, the script writing is pretty bad, folks. It's really, really bad. And yeah, of course, there's something going on with the human characters, but no one really cares, really. Well, at least I did, anyway. I was not really invested in their side of the story, like, at all. My name is Rick. Yeah, I'm Rick. Stop making fun of this movie, Killer Rodan, just because this is not a masterpiece of movies. My name is Rick. Yeah. So anyway, I was trying to say here is that, hey, get my video. My name's Rick. Get out of here, of course. Oh, my head! Oh, oh, damn it! Oh, my fish! Oh, 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 o
So uh, there's nothing else to this film but, you know, dogs, 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 dogs. That's about it. And that's, and that's like the only thing you can remember from this film is, from this film is just that. Just the dog alone. Nothing else, really. This is from the same company that produced Tangled, which I thought was a much, much better film. So what the hell happened here? Come on, the jokes and came out of care about some middle schooler. Come on. Hey, Mr. Monkey. No. I was that. No, no. Get out. Get. get. I'm not buying this on, on Blu ray. No. Okay. Anyway. Ah, damn. Ah, he's attacking me. Ah, stop it. Stop it. Ah. Dude. Ah. Ah. Bad movie. Sucks. And, yeah, I, I say skip it. This movie sucks. Ugh. Ah, uh, whatever. I'll look at the review. Alright. Put the movie right here. There we go. Bye, bad movie. There you go. It's been destroyed. Nothing was funny as I mentioned a moment ago. This was poorly written, poorly acted, and poorly edited. It just comes off really amateurish, folks. And you can tell that the dogs aren't, are not really moving the mouth, so that the CGI effects are pretty bad. And so overall, this was just a pretty bad film. It's not the absolute worst thing I've ever seen, but it is pretty bad. It's really bad, folks. Just everything about this film is. is just about everything's wrong. So I really don't suggest seeing this at all, folks. It get an overall rating of a 4.5 or 10. It get a 4.5 or 10 for me. As always, thanks for watching and take care. See you.